Namaste and I'm back uh, with chapter 19 from Ashtavakra Gita. In this chapter, King Janaka no longer describes his enlightened state uh, because he's just um, he's just heard the exquisite hundred verses of pure non-duality from Sage Ashtavakra and this has clearly impacted him and now he no longer continues to describe what his enlightened state is but speaks only in questions revealing absence. So chapter 19 it's titled Repose in the Self. King Janaka said With the tongs of truth, I have plucked the thorn of thinking from the innermost cave of my heart. Where is meditation, pleasure, prosperity or discrimination? Where is duality? Where even is unity? I abide in the glory of self. Where is past and future or even present? Where is space or even eternity? I abide in the glory of self. Where is self? Where is not self? Where is good and evil, confusion and clarity? I abide in the glory of self. Where is sleeping, dreaming, waking, or even the fourth state. Where is fear? I abide in the glory of self. Where is close or far, in or out, gross or subtle? I abide in the glory of self. Where is life and death? Where is the world and worldly relations? Where is distraction and stillness? I abide in the glory of self. There is no need to talk about the three ends of life. To talk of yoga is purposeless. Even talking about truth is irrelevant. I rest in self alone. With that, we complete chapter 19, Repose in Self, from Ashtavakra Gita. Thank you. Bye-bye.